Good. So as I said, we write in two postcards. Yes. Now it reminds, yeah, almost a reply. Uh, organizing situation is simple. This is for Alice. Now, how to write almost one? The same layout we imitate as it is in front of you, in your copy books, in your mind. So, now, this is very simple. Yeah, here it is. Yes. Uh, it is. Who is writing now? Yes, as it is. Yes. So we have Dakar. Place dates. I say today's dates. Yes. Yeah. This is what is. Give precision by using color. Yes. We see this is this is a two three. Hi. Yes. So variation. Glad to to learn or to hear. I insist to learn or to hear that you suck CDs in your back exam. Congratulations. Yes. So we have yours. We have What is okay? No. Organizing this, we have yes, I say there is a space, but yes, this is our stand. Yeah. Now Yes. Yeah. Very simple. We have Alice Bandara. This is what is name and address. Yes. La deuxième LL Bamako. Yeah. Here we're trying to, to set yes our postcard. Set it. Yeah, so lovely. Yes, here it is. Yeah, this is C1 position. 
Yeah, when you will try to see it, it is a short. Yeah, very short. So there is a problem of good news, congratulations as far as the different verb to use. I personally think here, or situation one was to inform or to annoy. Now in reply or congratulation, either we learn or we hear the reason why I have given precision, if you see, to inform, to annoy, and to hear, to learn. And it is very simple to, to understand. This is what we may give to pupils as far as any good news is concerned. So yes, and congratulations. It is very simple to understand, not difficult. It's due to their system of seriousness application. And if they are committed, I think there is no errors to provoke when writing postcard. This is what we need them to understand and to imitate. Yes, so here is a sample of good news and congratulations to write. So thank you for your attention and thank you so much again.